Experts are getting the word out that constantly holding your urine can pose a threat to your health. Nerve receptors tell the brain when it's time to go, but the brain also tells us to hold it. Have you ever ignored the urge to pee just because you were busy? Maybe you were watching a movie or stuck in traffic? It might seem harmless, but what really happens inside your body when you hold your urine for too long? Every time you drink water, juice, or any liquid, your body absorbs what it needs and sends the rest to your kidneys. These two bean-shaped organs work like filters, removing waste, toxins, and extra fluid from your blood. What's left behind becomes urine. From there, urine travels down thin tubes called ureters and collects in your bladder a stretchy, muscular balloon that expands as it fills up. When it reaches around 150 to 200 milliliters, your bladder sends a message to your brain. It's time to go. But what happens when you ignore that signal again and again? Maybe you're in a meeting, gaming, or simply too lazy to get up. If you do this often, you're forcing your bladder to hold more and more, sometimes up to 500 milliliters or more. That pressure builds up, making you uncomfortable and even painful. In very rare cases, if someone continues to hold their pee beyond a liter, the bladder could actually rupture a dangerous condition that needs surgery to repair. Even if it doesn't burst, there are serious risks. When urine stays in your bladder for too long, bacteria start to grow, leading to urinary tract infections or UTIs. These infections cause pain, burning, and fever, and can even spread to your kidneys. Over time, your bladder muscles can weaken or stretch out, losing their ability to contract normally. This means your bladder might not empty completely, leaving leftover urine that keeps feeding bacteria and causing discomfort. In severe cases, it can even lead to kidney damage. While a one-time delay won't hurt you, making it a habit definitely can. So, when your body says it's time to go listen to it, don't train yourself to ignore the urge. If you're traveling or somewhere without a restroom, try to take breaks every few hours to let your bladder relax. And keep an eye on your urine color, light yellow or clear. You're hydrated. Dark yellow or amber, you probably need more water. Your pee can tell you a lot more about your health than you think. So next time that little voice in your head says, I can hold it a bit longer, don't. Your bladder is not a storage tank. Treat it well and it'll take care of you for life. If you found this helpful, share it with someone who always says, I'll go later and subscribe for more health facts that could literally save your body from the inside out.